Hey, I'm Bennett Schiller, pastor of education, and I want to tell you about an exciting study in the book of Psalms I'll be teaching this fall on Sunday evenings at FBU. Many of us have favorite Psalms that we love. Some of us have memorized the 23rd Psalm, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. We read the Psalms over and over again and seemingly never tire of their uplifting words. Why is this? It's because the psalm speaks to our everyday needs, joys, and heartaches of life. On Sunday evenings this fall, we're going to explore the book of he this book of Hebrew poetry and look at its songs, prayers, and praises and learn why we love these things so very much. Were you aware that the 119th Psalm has 176 verses and is one of the longest books in the Bible? Were you also aware that David did not write all the Psalms? Solomon wrote two Psalms and Moses wrote one Psalm. Many of God's Psalms were written by others who bring these wonderful verses to our heart. From ancient times, the Psalms were divided into five books and were really intended to be sung. David had an orchestra of 4,000 instruments. Some were wind instruments, others were uh, string instruments, some were meant to be beaten, such as tambourines and cymbals. Many of the Psalms were written a thousand years before Christ, but yet they point to the coming Messiah and that great King. These are called the Messianic Psalms. There are other Psalms called the Precator and Precatory Psalms, and the Psalmist would shower curses on his enemies. We will look at these Psalms and many other features of the Psalms in the uh, study. Uh, the Psalms are uh, like a rich gold mine waiting to be discovered. So pick up your pick and shovel and come along with us on Sunday evenings as we explore the richness of these Psalms. I hope I'll see you on September the 8th.